Hi everyone, this is Hena Talati and you are watching It's Tomorrow News. Long term heavy rainfall in Roraima, particularly in northern areas of Brazil along with the high levels of rivers in Amazon basin upstream have caused rivers to rise above flood stage in the state. The government of the state of Roraima in northern Brazil has declared an emergency situation due to the ongoing heavy rainfall and rising rivers. Banco River of Brazil stood at 8.53 meters with the flood stage at 8.5 meters. Likewise, the Branco was also above flood stage in the various areas at 9.46 meters as of 11th June. Agencies said that overflowing rivers and heavy rain has caused damage to infrastructures such as bridges, roads, and side roads which created traffic difficulties on these roads, production flow and access to the hospitals and villages. Many communities were isolated by the flooding. Civil defense had to deliver food and medical supplies and help to rescue people from the flooded areas. Dozens of the families were evacuated in many areas. In the municipality of Amajari, around 20 families have been severely affected by flooding from the overflowing river since early June. This flooding has severely impacted the livelihoods of over 200 families families in the municipality. More than 250 millimeters of the rain had fell in Canhelina in the state of Santa Catarina, South Brazil in 24 hours. At least seven other locations in the state saw more than 150 millimeters of rain during the same period. The municipality and the city of Canhelina in the south of Brazil was one of the hardest hit where dozens of the homes were flooded and 146 people evacuated to temporary shelter. Other rescues and evacuations were carried out in Basque and Italajai. In total, at least 16 municipalities have reported incidents of flooding and severe weather impacts with further heavy rainfall forecast in this region. More over 25 municipalities in the neighboring state of Amazonas have also declared a state of emergency due to the widespread flooding. As of early June, more than 4,50,000 people had been affected. The Negro River at Manaus, capital of state, reached the record high of 29.98 meters on 1st of June 2021. At that time, almost all of Amazonas state was affected and caused damage in nearly 60 of 62 municipalities. The Amazonas River had also reached the peak levels in the various cities located in the east of the state. The neighboring country of Guyana had endured severe flooding since mid-May. As of early June, over 25,000 households had been affected. That's all for now. For more news updates, stay tuned with us. It's tomorrow news, Hena Talati. For more weather updates like this and please subscribe our channel.